what is up danny gang welcome back to our channel so y'all happy christmas eve y'all i am so excited for christmas but i'm really excited for it to come and go i'm just like i want to get back on track i want to get like in a groove of things i want to like start fresh so i'm just like super excited for christmas to like spend time with family and friends but i'm also really excited to like get back like to a routine like i think everybody always says that but I'm out and about. I got up this morning, um, cleaned up the apartment. I still got a little bit of cleaning to do, but I cleaned the apartment. I took Benji out for a walk, fed him. He's acting kind of weird with food the last two days. Like, I'm not sure what's going on, but I'm going to boil him like a new chicken breast. Um, Cause I'm not sure what it is with him and food. Um, yesterday afternoon and this morning, he just hasn't been wanting to eat the food that he has. So I'm gonna boil him a new chicken breast. Maybe that's it because he always wants a piece of chicken. So I'm not really sure what's going on. I mean, typically he eats the same chicken breast like for a couple days. So I'm not really sure what's going on with that. But um, I did get up this morning and I went out and about, ran some errands. I did run inside of CVS for Babe to grab a few last minute gifts for um, his coworker, which I will show you because I think that the items are really cute, very functional and a cute little gift for like your friends. Like I'm a firm believer in giving gifts first of all y'all know i'm a firm believer in giving gifts to people who give me something but also i do love to just give i do random uh giveaways i pick people and give them books and stuff from their amazon wish list so i do believe in like random um nice acts of kindness um speaking of that i am hosting a little giveaway over on my book club so with it being Christmas and the holiday season, I decided to give away our January book club pick. So it might be too late when you guys are seeing this, but I did um, raffle off our book for the book club, um, Where He Can't Find You by Darcy Coates. So I'm super excited. I have the little um, raffle going on now. Um, so people who want to win the book, all I had them do was like thumbs up the post and then I'll put all their names in a bucket and I'll pull because I like to give back. But yeah, he picked some really cute things that I definitely will show y'all once I get parked. I'm headed back home. Um, so yeah, woke up this morning, walked Benji, tried to feed him. He didn't eat um, that much. So um, then I just cleaned up the apartment, made me some coffee. Y'all know I'm loving that instant coffee. So I made me some coffee um and then kept cleaning up i had to fold clothes i'm washing like our sheets i cleaned all our bathrooms i'm just cleaning up because we don't plan to have company over but knowing babe and like his family his sisters and brothers they'll probably stop by anyway either tonight or tomorrow after like the festivities at his mom house so i just want to be prepared i already got liquor y'all saw I got sodas and stuff, but y'all, I'm just like so ready for Christmas to be over. I feel crazy. So I'm actually quite ready to jump into like dry January. And I know like I could have done it already and like you could stop drinking and blah, 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 blah. But I don't know. It's something about just like a purpose for it. Like dry January is a thing. So I'm like ready for it. Um, I'm ready for a lot in 2024. Um, 2023 was crazy for me. I'm just sitting here reflecting. Like, 2023 was absolutely eight shit bananas. And I'm just, like, I fell off a lot on so many different things, which makes me sad. But also makes me happy to know that I see the light at the end of the tunnel. And I'm ready for a new year to, like, start. Like, new year, new me. But, like, seriously, like, 2023 was absolutely eight shit. And I'm just happy to be, like, back on a, on a you know on a plan and I don't have to feel so confused and worried and stressed about money and all of that so really excited about that um so yeah got some last minute little gifts for babes friends at work and then what did I get I got a couple things out of Dollar Tree um and that's about it like I said I'm ready to just like start over fresh um, I have like a little pimple patch on. I can't even, I don't even know if y'all can tell because I got a pimple right above my eyebrow, 
which is kind of weird. I typically don't get pimples um, as much, so kind of weird. But yeah, let me park and then I'll show y'all what babe, what I picked up at CVS because you also could, well, it's probably too late, but I'm gonna still show y'all possibly for next year. All right, gang, so lighting is kind of trash, but I'm just about to show y'all real quick. So I actually picked up something for me. It was advertised, I think, for $19, but it was on sale for seven. So it is this compact charging station, and I'm gonna put it on my side of the bed, y'all, because I don't have anything on my side of the bed to like charge my Kindle, iPad, my phones, my headphones, everything is just like loose. So I did get this for me, and like I said, oh no, it was $9.99, I thought it was $19. So it was $9.99, but I actually rang up for like $7 which is pretty crazy. I did keep the receipt just in case so that I can um, take it back if it doesn't do what it's supposed to do. But basically you just run all your cords through the back of it and just set it on your counter or whatever. I'm gonna set it on my side table. So we'll see about this. I'm excited for it. I'm gonna do that as soon as we get there. But um, I got this. So when we were in there yesterday, Babe got one of these for one of his coworkers. And now he, he was like, oh, well, can you grab another one when you go out? Because he's actually working today, Christmas Eve, crazy, right? But anyway, um, it's a cute little coin toss game. And he said that he was going to put give it to his coworker so they can just keep it on their desk. So he got one yesterday for one of his coworkers. And then I went back today and got another one. And these were actually on sale for $1.99, which is so cool. And then, at, um, and then yesterday I got, well, we got this little canister of cookies. So yeah, this is a cute little gift for... A little friend a work friend um and he they can keep it in the office play maybe do some bets i don't know but yes yeah, just a cute little coin toss so i thought that that was super cute and it was a great price um can i show y'all anything else i think that's pretty much it uh yep and then i just got some bags i got one other little thing and then i got a mat for my bathroom because i don't have a bath mat so I just got like one of those dollar ones. I mean, five dollar ones at Dollar Tree. So yeah, if y'all have a CVS or whatever, maybe next year for Christmas. I think people sleep on CVS because we sure did. But maybe next year for Christmas, y'all can check and see like what y'all CVS got going on because that was actually pretty good deals. But yeah, y'all, I'm not going to do too much today. Um, I turned on my Grubhub app, but it wasn't really popping. So I may go back out later and try to get like some of the Grubhub money because I'm sure a lot of people are going to be ordering food because they don't want to cook. They busy. So I'll probably go back out later because it's not popping right now. Um, but I am going to go um, put the clothes in the dryer because I've been washing and all that good stuff. So I'm going to go set up this charging station and then I'll show y'all. But hopefully you guys are having a happy New Year's Eve. I mean, Christmas Eve. Um, we're almost done. So I'm going to post this video at some point today because Babe and I are also going to open up our stockings. So I'll probably show you guys what I got in my stocking. His stocking is always, always, always full of self-care. So like beard stuff, face masks, um, lip products. Like I always put just a whole bunch of self-care stuff um, in his in his um, stocking. But I don't know what's in mine. So that'll be fun. Um, so I'll show y'all what's in my stocking because we always open our stockings on New Year's Eve. And then we, I mean, on Christmas eve sam so ready to get to the new year and then we'll um open up our presents obviously when we wake up in the morning um and then we'll carry all of the presents that we got for family um for his family over to his mom's house but anyway i'm looking crazy like i said i wasn't doing too much i don't plan on doing anything i want to relax so i'm gonna go ahead and go upstairs and then i will be back to show y'all the charging station <laughs> What I just told y'all, I love these. Thank you, babe. This is my favorite. Y'all, if you ain't had no Victor Roth, I ain't even gone. Don't tell them. Oh, uh, thank you. Y'all know I love Alani New. Y'all know I love fuzzy socks. This is my stocking, by the way. <gasps> Y'all, this is for my Kindle. I'm about to set it up right now. This is for my Kindle. So basically, I'll show y'all. 
mask. Thank you. Ooh, gummy bears. Thank you. Ooh, bath bombs. Thank you. Ooh, kettle corn. If y'all don't know, this is my favorite type of popcorn. What I'm most excited about is my page turner, my um, peach energy drink mix, and my Victor Rock. All right, so here's Benjamin stocking. <laughs> so this is Benjamin stocking, y'all. He don't have that much stuff in here, but I got him a couple little toys. Bae, you put something in here. So I got him some a couple little toys and some little treats. Nothing crazy, but it's so cute. So we're going to go ahead and unbox his as well. Babe loved his stocking. I love mine. I cannot wait to set everything up with y'all. But yeah, so here's Puda. There's his stocking. Boo boo. Hold on, Buddha. All right. Be waiting on your dad. You want to open it? Okay. What you got in there? What's in there, boy? What's in there? What's in there? Get your favorite stuff out. Here. Look at this, Buddha. Oh, my gosh. You got another one? Oh. You got something else, too. Look. Your favorite. <gasps> so if y'all don't know, these are his favorite toys. They literally, I can't even get one. Y'all, these are his favorite toys. They come from Dollar Tree. As you guys can see, we bought him so many different toys and those are his favorite, clearly. And then, hold up, what else you got? <gasps> this is the last thing. <gasps> got some Christmas milk balls. And then I just put these in here, y'all. Just some little snacks for him. But yeah, these are the stars of the show. He literally loves these so much. So if you have a, a Yorkie or like a small dog, I don't know what it is about these, but they love them. 